How's it going guys? We are back on the video here and it's my best cards to buy in every price range in NHL 24 hut as of December 29th. Probably make another one of these videos after team of the year, see when the market is then, but hopefully you guys do enjoy. This is a long one. I put a lot of time into this one. Make sure you guys leave a like, subscribe if you have not already, and let's hop into the video right now. Starting off with base Nathan McKinnon here, six foot, 200 pounds, right-handed winger, I call him. I don't really play this card at center. I mean, he's got 80 face-offs. That's really not good enough. This is a five to 25K price range, but 92 speed, 92 acceleration, silver unstoppable force. All these stats are very good for a base card, and I think Nathan McKinnon is absolutely one of the best cards to buy in this price range. Brendan Shanahan, Shanahan here at 85 overall, 6'3", 220 pounds, right-handed winger. He's got 88 speed, 88 excel, silver unstoppable force. I like this card a lot just because he's got good size, good skating, pretty good shot as well. And for about 15,000 coins, to me, that's an absolute steal. Uh, and I like Shanahan's card a lot. Got 85 Nylander here, 6 foot 204, right-handed winger, 90 speed, 90 excel. He's got silver, make it snappy. Playmaking forward as a synergy, but uh, for the most part, I enjoy this William Nylander card a lot. I think he's a very nice card. Uh, and for me, for... Basically, under 20k, it's a very good deal, I think. 85, Patrick Line. So, Line doesn't have the greatest skating, but you know what makes Line that good? He is 6'5", 205. Unbelievable size. And he's got sniper forward synergy. And look at that shot. For an 85 overall card, you're not finding many 85s that have a shot as good as that. 92, 92, 93, and 91. I mean, that is absolutely crazy. Awesome shot for Line. He's got silver. Make it snappy here, too. But for the most part, this Line card is just absolutely cracked. I mean, for an 85 overall, I think it's just... Just pure robbery, personally. John Klingberg, 85 overall. I mentioned him in my best defenseman uh, video, but he's 6'3", 190. Right-handed D-man, offensive defenseman, and silver seeing eye. Not a great ability here on Klingberg, but he's more of an offensive D-man, so it's not really that shocking to me that he's going to have that. But 89 Excel and 89 speed on him. Decent shot, not really the greatest offensively, but very cheap card, and I think he's really good. Here we go with 85, Dobson, right-handed D-man, 6'4", 194. He's got silver thunderclap, two-way defenseman synergy, 87 speed, 87 excel. I think Dobson plays very well in this game. I'm a fan of him for sure, and I, rec I definitely recommend him to you guys for only like 20,000 coins. Not bad at all. And then last but not least in this range, we're going to go with Quinn Hughes' base card. 5'10", 180, left-handed D-man, off of the defenseman. He's got silver wheels, 92 speed, 92 acceleration. For a base card, Quinn Hughes checks all the boxes. Yes, his checking's pretty subpar, but that's fine. He's still a very good skating defenseman. Now let's move on to the next price range of 26 to 50,000 coins. Starting off with Connor McDavid, base card, who plays a lot better than an 86 does. So he's around 40,000 coins, 6'1", 193, left-handed. Handed winger as all, also is what I'll, I'll say about him. Very similar to McKinnon. His faceoffs aren't good enough to play center to me at least. Uh, silver ankle breaker. 93 speed. 93 acceleration on McDavid here. And just as always as I mentioned guys. To me he's like the best card like in the game basically. Like I don't know. McDavid. McDavid always just, just plays so well. For whatever reason McDavid he could be 88 overall. And he'll be playing better than a 92 overall. I don't know what it is. His size. Whatever it might be. It's just literally the perfect amount. He's just so good McDavid. Next up, we got Alexis Lafreniere, left winger, playmaker, 6'1", 194. He's got playmaking forward, agile dangler boost, silver born leader, and gold unstoppable force. Loveless laugh card, though. It's a custom build. He's got 90 acceleration, 90 speed. His shots, 86, 86, 89, and 89 here. Uh, great hands on his card, for sure. Uh, but to me, Laugh plays very well. Uh, this is a nice card, a custom build card. All the custom build cards are always good. I'm, I'm glad when they do that. Hopefully they can keep doing that. But Laugh is a very nice card, and I think it's, uh, it's a good one in this range. Then we got Dylan Larkin, 86 overall, stars of the month, 6'1", 198, left-handed centerman. Uh, he's got playmaking forward. He's got the actual accelerator boost, too. You can get up to 95 acceleration here, 93 speed. His shot's very, very mid. That's the only thing about Larkin's car is always his shot's always just underwhelming. He's got silver wheels, gold born leader on this card here. Uh, he's got pretty good hands too, Larkin. That's that's a nice thing to see, but uh, other than that, very solid card. Clayton Keller, 86 overall, another custom build card here. 5'10", 178, left-handed. He's got playmaking forward, agile dangler boost, silver elite edges, and gold make it snappy. 93 acceleration, a 92 speed. He's got unreal skating here. Shots 89, 85, 91, and 87. Uh, Clayton Keller is fantastic, and he's really one I recommend. 
Timu Solani, 86 overall, 6 foot 209, right handed. He's got sniper forward, agile dangler boost, silver wheels, gold elite edges, but 93 speed and excel. That's what makes this card fantastic. Very good shot, though, too. Pretty good hands. Solani, to me, very good card in this price range. A base Kalma car. Always got to give him his flowers. 5'11, 187, right handed D man with offensive defenseman, silver wheels, 93 speed, 93 acceleration. He is always just that good. I don't care his size doesn't matter to me. He's just that good. His speed is really enough to make up for any sort of small issues that he might have. Kevin Korczynski, I'm going to say here, 85 overall, 6'3", 192, left-handed D-man, offensive defenseman. He's got silver wheels, too. Uh, I just like this Kevin Korczynski card, though. Very solid, 87 Excel, 87 speed. Uh, pretty good defensive awareness on him. He's just a fun, fun little card to use here. Let's move on to the next 51 to 100K price range now, guys. Starting off with Brett Hole. This kind of surprised me that he's only going for 60,000 coins. I understand. I always understand. His skating is not great. But do you guys see that shot? If you're able to activate even one of the synergies. 99, 99, 99, 98. I don't care what his skating is. That is ridiculous. 89 Excel, 89 Speed. Unbelievable shot. He's got Gold Snipe, Silver 1T, Silver Magnetic. Play this guy with like fast fast center, a fast right winger, and you'll have a lot of success. I mean, this is a ridiculous car. I don't care what anyone says. At 87 Barzell, he's a burner. 6'1", 190. You can have actually 97 speed with synergies there. 93 Excel, silver elite edges, gold wheels on his card. 87, 86, 87, and 87 for his shot here. Uh, I like his Barzell card a lot. Uh, he's just fantastic. Austin Matthews. He's got sniper forward and shooting boost, giving him a ridiculous shot. He's got unstoppable force and gold close quarters. So some nice abilities on Matthews here too. Uh, and for me, guys, he's one of the better options in this range. With 90 overall, Hillary Knight. She's 5'11", 172. She's got sniper forward, power forward, shooting boost, playmaking boost, 92 acceleration, 92 speed, really good abilities too. Elite edges, unstoppable force, make it snappy, and gold born leader. Uh, she's fantastic. 93, 93, 91, and 91. Really awesome, awesome abilities and synergies on her card. No question about it. Overall, six foot. 205, he's got offensive defensemen, speed boost, accelerated boost, whatever one you want. Could have actually 93 speed or acceleration. Goldborn leader, silver wheels, and silver thunderclap. So very nice abilities on this card here. Noah Dobson, 86 overall, 6'4", 194, right-handed D-man, two-way defenseman, shooting boost, 89 speed, 89 excel, gold elite edges too on this card. Uh, this Dobson card is very, very solid in my opinion. So uh, that's kind of it for this price range, guys. Except for we got one more guy, Ian McKinnon. I was about to not use him. 6'4", 200 pounds, right-handed. He's got playmaking forward, shooting boost, 94 speed, 94 acceleration, goalie lead edges, silver ensemble force, and silver heat seeker. McKinnon just plays fantastic in this game. Now move on to 101 to 200k, guys. Starting off with 88 Mario Lemieux. 6'4", 230, right-handed. Uh, he's got sniper forward and playmaking forward. I'd probably play him on the wing. His face-offs are only 84 here. Goal ensemble force, silver close quarters, and silver born leader. Nice abilities. 91 excel and speed. I use this card on my PlayStation team, and he's quite good. I can't deny it. Then I gotta mention 90 Solani. This card is ridiculous. He's got 94 acceleration and speed. Playmaking boost, sniper forward, speed boost or agile dangler boost can get up to 96 speed. He's got goal, make it snappy, puck on the string, off the rush, and beauty backhand. Uh, he's an awesome card. He really is Solani. He always plays so well in game, and this card is no different. I gotta talk about this 89 Yager card. Oh my, this card's good. 6'3", 230. He's got sniper forward. He's got playmaking boost or agile dangler boost, but look at this card. 6'3", 92 Excel, and 93 speed for, for this Yager card. Unsolvable force, tape of tape, and gold elite edges. Yager, this card is absolutely broken. I mean, what a card here by EA. I mentioned 89 Dobson here, too. 6'4", 194, right-handed D-man. Two-way defenseman, playmaking boost or defensive boost, silver quick pick is awesome, silver seeing eye, gold tape of tape is whatever, but 90 acceleration and 90 speed on the 6-4 Dobson is really, really good. Victor Hedman, 88 as well, 6-7, 244, 
Left-handed D-man. He's got two-way defensemen and the shooting boost. But gold shutdowns is what I really like about his card. 96 defensive awareness is crazy. Uh, this admin card is really, really good. I absolutely recommend to you guys. Mention Yossi as well. Yossi plays fantastic in this game. 6-1-2-0-1. Left-handed D-man. Two-way defenseman. He's got 98 defensive awareness there. Silver shutdown. Silver ice pack. Goal heat seeker is okay, but uh, really just such a such a good card. This Roman Yossi card really is. 88 Makar, I got to mention here too. He's 94 speed and excel. Gold elite edges. Silver wheels on Makar here. Uh, just a really, really fun card to use is uh, Kale Makar. Let's move into 201 to 300,000 coins. There it is. Not many options. We got 91 Nathan McKinnon, 6 foot, 200 pounds. He's got sniper forward, power forward, shooting boost, and checking boost, but 96 excel and 96 speed. That is ridiculous. His shot's crazy. Gold snipe, silver 1T, silver unsolvable force, and silver puck on a string. McKinnon checks off all the boxes. Wow, he's here. 91 Jack Hughes, 5 11, 175, sniper forward, playmaking forward, agile dangler boost, shooting boost, 95 acceleration, 94 speed, silver make it snappy, silver puck on a string, silver 1T, and gold elite edges. Just tremendous, tremendous abilities on this card, and tremendous card in general. 9 McDavid here as well, 6'1", 193, 95 speed, 95 acceleration, silver snipe, silver wheels, gold unstoppable force, ridiculous card here. It's got playmaking forward, shooting boost, or playmaking boost. McDavid absolutely, guys, in this car, in this range, I mean, he's probably the best one, let's be real. He's so fun to use. 9 Makar here, 95 speed, 95 excel, offensive defenseman synergy, agile dangler boost, or shooting boost, silver wheels, silver heat seeker, and gold elite edges. So good. Kale Makar, one of the best cards out there. So now we're in the 300, 301k plus range. So it's just the best cards, right? So Gretzky, Lemieux, obviously, these are the best cards probably in the range because, I mean, you can get them up to 92 overall. And they're some of the best cards in the game. No question about it. Same thing for Lemieux. They're just end game cards. That's just straight up how it is. I'm not really going to go over each card because there's not that many cards to really talk about. Uh, but Lemieux and Gretzky for sure are no doubters. And then I got to mention 90 overall, Connor McDavid, no question about it. Card's ridiculous. He's got 95 excel, 95 speed. So it's like a plus one to the 89. Very similar card, no speed boost or anything like that. But Unsolvable Force, make it snappy, Elite Edges, and Ankle Breaker. And then last but not least, uh, the right D that I want to mention here is going to be Kale McCarr, 91 overall edition. 300K is the only defenseman that goes for that much. And it's deserved. 96 acceleration and 96 speed. I mean, what a card this is. And it's been a long one, guys. If you made it all the way to the end of this video, please comment that down below. I'd really appreciate it. I mean, wow, that was, that was a journey right there. And I hope this video does help you guys out. I know it's one of my longer ones that I've uploaded here in a while. But uh, I like to always make these videos because I know it's important for you guys. They're always asking, you know, who should I get? Who should I get? Well, hopefully this does help you guys out. Any questions? please comment down below. I'm always down to help you guys out with team building, all right? Hey guys, thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, please make sure you leave a like, subscribe if you have not already, and follow me on Twitch, Henrik. I'm live there every single day. Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, Henrik at three E's. And be sure to join my Discord, talk to me, followers, and subscribers to the channel. And I'll see you guys all in the next video.